Happy, happy Friday, March 12th. I'm Timmy O'Neill. Thank you for joining me on Embrace Life. Uh, if you're new here, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. Let's dive right into the news that happened from yesterday. Biden signs the $1.9 trillion bill, which should start rolling out next week. Uh, this was a huge surprise because as of um, Wednesday night, they were just planning on doing an announcement or uh, like a ceremony for signing it, and uh, he ended up signing it. So we've got the, the bill is law now. So uh, $300 unemployment extension till September 6th or 9th, I think it is. Um, but there is going to be a two-week lapse in unemployment, so be prepared for that. So, yeah, you might get your stimulus check, but you might uh, see some bumps in the roads with your uh, uh, unemployment. Now, uh, also, people who have filed their taxes uh, ahead of time, uh, I'm seeing a lot of people uh, panicking and saying that, oh, my gosh, I need to amend my taxes. I also filed my taxes right when I was readily available. But I have heard from many sources not to do anything to wait for guidance from the IRS.gov website that they will probably be handling this internally as an, sending out an adjustment. So don't freak out and think that you have to make an amendment right away until you hear guidance from IRS.gov. You'll probably get a text message or an email with notifications. Um, they, they do like to do that. If you get a phone call from somebody from the IRS, you're, that's not the IRS. That's a scammer. They don't call people. Um, they don't pay somebody to reach out to somebody else uh, to interrupt their day. Uh, they like to keep it in-house. So don't panic. Uh, child tax credit included. Uh, minimum wage was not included. And I don't think minimum wage is going to make the infrastructure package uh, as well. But just keep this in mind. Biden's been moving pretty fast. Yeah, he hasn't followed through with a couple of things, but the promises that he made uh, prior to being elected uh, and, and or winning the election, he, he's been pretty, uh, pretty close to the chest, if you will. Um, I, now, I do see and I, I have noticed, I mean, uh, that he hasn't done a lot of interviews. He, they haven't been putting him out there, but I don't... I don't, I'm not surprised by that. They probably know that he's a horrible speaker, that everybody was, you know, following suit to the Sleepy Joe or, you know, what have you. But at any rate, it is what it is. I digress. We have a stimulus pass pa uh, package passed. Wow. <laughs> um, it's, uh, expect to see more movement next week rolling out. Uh, now, I've seen things from the Fed saying that they can dole out money within um, 24 hours um, they can have 50 million checks out. Yet to be seen. They've had, they've been having issues all over. Let me know when you guys get your uh, direct deposit if you've already filed your taxes. Um, uh, let me know also if you've had any issues with, like, let's say you are a uh, gig worker or sole proprietor and you're on PUA or you were worried about getting PUA if you're, like, in a cash business. Because my dad's in a uh, cash business. He runs an um, auto mechanic shop. And a lot of his business is done through cash transactions. Uh, a lot of times he doesn't make enough money to um, warrant uh, the effort. But I'm telling you guys, you're getting support now. If you're a gig worker, sole proprietor, LLC, you own your own business, reach out for PUA. It's money that you've been paying in for years and you're entitled to it. It's, it's, to, it's for this very reason that you know your business needs help you need help get your help reach out to pua it'll be worth it go to the irs.gov website or google search uh, pandemic unemployment assistance uh, and use the link to get to the irs.gov website that's designated for filing um, so there's that the infrastructure is out of the way uh, let's talk about um, let's talk about crypto uh, the market obviously with the news of the stimulus checks is uh, definitely affecting the cryptocurrency market as well as the stock market as well as um, you know the value of gold the value of dollar we're talking about all these things that are, that are intertwined so um, we've got let's let's start with ethereum the the news for ethereum which is huge by the way uh, just with yesterday's cup and handle on my technical analysis for everybody in our workshop guys 
Bitcoin is going to explode. Ethereum is going to explode. Cardano works against Ethereum. Um, so pr you're probably going to see them um, them explode as well. Uh, if you're a U.S. resident, you probably are not likely to have access to Polkadot. Um, one thing you can do, and also, by the way, if you do have Coinbase, you can now um, buy Polygon uh, altcoin and Stake uh, altcoin. Both of those are now on the Coinbase uh, market. Also, um, if you have Token Pocket and you already have Ethereum, you can literally use your Ethereum wallet to swap your Ethereum for Polkadot. Um it's it's a nifty little scenario they they don't have their own specific um exchange for um polka dot but you can swap your ethereum for polka dot internally on that exchange it's also a cold wallet so you can secure your money there on stablecoin um that being said i love and appreciate all of you guys look at the exponential growth going on with ethereum it's already at 1800 with the cup and handle from my ta yesterday for, for both bitcoin and ethereum i see uh bitcoin probably hitting 61,000, 62 maybe um with the cup and handle and the the bull run that it's on right now it, it'll probably get some lower resistance but it, if that happens i see ethereum not only hitting 2400 by in, in days but uh, uh mid-march is going to be an explosion the uh optimism rollouts uh this month will lower gas prices for ethereum uh the chances of a berlin fork in april uh plus eth 2.0 comes out in july uh the eip 1559 i know this is probably a lot of this is over your head if you guys are ever interested in getting involved in cryptocurrency reach out to uh, me directly at embrace life tim i'll show you what we do in our workshop um, basically our, the workshop started with all of us just investing in Ethereum because none of us had really any experience in it. None of us really knew anything about crypto and we're all learning this together. Remember, I am not a CPA. I'm not a financial advisor. This is only my personal experience. Please seek out financial advice from an advisor. Also, stay away from taking advice from random people off of social networks that are not financial advisors or CPAs. They're only looking out for their bottom line. You're seeing a million different people saying, I'm a genius, I'm making a ton of money in altcoins, and these are the altcoins that you're going to buy, and, and I know that this is going to explode based on this. I'm sorry, I don't know enough about what's going on with these altcoins. I know I'm learning slowly, just like everybody else here that's dipping their feet in. Um, but it pays to understand the crypto coin that you're buying into. So don't just take somebody's advice. Do your due diligence. Ask people uh, for their input and don't accept their word as, you know, word of God. Uh, other than that, I love and appreciate all of you guys. Happy, f uh, oh my God, this Friday is already starting off amazing, guys. Uh, I want to have a great weekend. I was actually just considering going down to New York City to visit some friends um, and taking the taking the sights um, while it's easier to move around. There's a lot of people in New York City, but lately it's been kind of less cluttered. And I, I was always the type of person that would like, I would go to a, a big full day event concert and... You know, just crowds in general, I don't really care for, like, in, in, in an enclosed environment. So, like, you're in a, you know, a, a bar watching a band play with, like, 300 people. That's way too close for me. That's, like, mosh pit close. And uh, I don't need to know you guys that well. <laughs> uh, in fact, it's weird, though. Like, I, the first country concert I went to was outdoors, and people were throwing beer bottles. I'm like, I thought country was supposed to be peaceful. This is more... This is more violence than I see at mosh pits. Anyway, I digress. I'm not going to New York City. I was going to, um, on, on a brief whim, it was like 53 bucks for the train to go down there. It's a seven-hour train ride. Uh, never really got to enjoy a luxurious train ride, so it would have been pretty fun to you know, grab a few drinks, chillax, and then boom, Penn Station, New York City. Would have been awesome. 
I digress. I love and appreciate all of you guys. I hope you guys have great plans for this weekend. Let me know what you think in the comments below about uh, all this stuff going on with the infrastructure package. Do you think it's too much? Do you think a, a, a reoccurring payment is something that is conceivable and would be good for our country? Um, also, let me know what you're doing this weekend. Are you doing any barbecues? Anybody having anything fun? This The weather is intensely amazing. Intensely amazing. I'm enjoying it every day. Hopefully you are too. <laughs> I love and appreciate all of you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Uh, it, it helps share my content uh, on YouTube uh, with more people. Uh, that algorithm, it picks up on comments. So please leave a comment. Say random comment. You like it, you subscribe it, you're entered to win my giveaway. It's $2,000 when I hit 3,000 uh, subscribers. Uh, if you're ever interested in getting any uh, swag from, from the channel... Um, you can reach out to me directly. The hoodies are 60 bucks. They're coming all different colors, all different sizes. Uh, four different prints. Uh, one with a chest badge. That's for the straight up zipper. Uh, and then I got t-shirts for 20 bucks. Um, the anniversary of me hitting a thousand subscribers. I had a bunch of shirts made. I'd probably do a giveaway this weekend. I'm feeling uh, like we could all use a little... Uh, dark side of the moon <laughs> uh, i love and appreciate all of you guys uh let me know what you think of the content today if you have any questions or suggestions for further content um you know please feel free to leave them in the comments i i reach out to everybody on the comments um also be aware that if you do not see like a check mark next to the name with my picture uh of my channel with my um with my cartoon me then that's not me. That's a bot. I don't give out my WhatsApp, uh, WhatsApp number or Telegram number or give advice like that. It, it, it's one thing to reach out to me and enter the workshop, which we're all in and we're all inexperienced and learning together. But I'm not going to go out and tell you, hey, I'm a professional and this is I've made millions or hundreds of thousands of dollars and 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 put that all in the comments i'm not going to do all that stuff that's nonsense that's scammers um the bots are killing me i'm trying to delete them as i go thank you guys for being patient uh i want to thank zach sawyer and um cal baker uh for joining the workshop guys uh we'll be seeing each other later today it'll it'll be awesome to invite you to check out this um crowdfunding platform i love and appreciate all of you guys if you guys are more interested in that stuff reach out to me directly on twitter at embrace life tim uh, as always we'll be talking soon